San Francisco's hotel industry is facing a deep financial crisis, as outlined in the Wall Street Journal article titled San Francisco is sinking in bad hotel debt. Since the pandemic, the city's hospitality sector has been hit hard by a sharp decline in visitors. With hotel occupancy rates plummeting, especially on weekends, a key measure of leisure travel, the industry is struggling to stay afloat. As a result, many of the city's hotels are now drowning in debt, with the value of major properties dropping substantially. One of the key factors contributing to this downturn is the significant decrease in both tourists and business travelers. San Francisco, once a hotspot for conferences, tourism, and tech-related business travel, has seen its visitor numbers dwindle since the pandemic. The city's high operational costs, paired with the increasingly challenging business environment, have only compounded the financial difficulties for hotels. While major metropolitan areas have started to recover, San Francisco continues to lag, with fewer guests and fewer revenue streams. The financial outlook for the city's hotel industry remains bleak. Many hotel owners are grappling with large debts that they are unable to service, leading to a rise in distressed properties. Without a significant increase in tourism and business travel, or solutions to the city's high cost structure, the hospitality sector faces a long road to recovery. The situation has raised concerns about the future of the city's iconic hotels and whether San Francisco can regain its status as a top destination for travelers. 